important test you'll be doing in any laboratory. It can be a small laboratory up to a hospital based, even a referral laboratory. Urine analysis is one of the most important and regularly being done tests on a normal laboratory practice. Urine has three components of reporting. First is the macroscopy, that is the appearance and the color of the urine. Second comes the chemical analysis in which you'll be seeing whether there is albumin, there is sugar, there is blood. And the third comes the microscopic examination in which you'll be seeing the deposits, whether there is RBCs, WBCs, whatever, whether there are E cells, you will be seeing in your microscopic examination of this urine. If you're running a laboratory and you get only below 10 samples per day, you can, you can stick on to the manual method. When you have more than 10 samples or you're going to expect to scale up your laboratory, which will have a minimum of 10 samples up to 50 to 60 samples on a daily basis, you can opt for a semi-automated urine analyzer. And the third one is the completely automated urine analyzer in which you must need a minimum sample load of 50 to 60 samples per day. So in this semi-automated and the completely automated analyzer, the major difference here is that in a semi-automated, you would be seeing the macroscopic appearances visually. That is your technician or you have to see the color and the appearance with your naked eyes and report. Apart from that, you after that is done, you have to take the strip which can have 10 parameters. So these 10 parameters includes everything uh, like your glucose, your albumin, your ketones, your bilirubin, the blood, everything will be included as parameters in this 10 strips. What you have to do is after that you dip this inside the urine and you insert it inside your semi-automated analysis and through the uh, process of you know reflectance photometry these machines work and it will give you a report within a minute and these are also LIS compatible and this is about the semi-automated analyzer. When you go on to a completely automated urine analyzer, even the macroscopic examinations, everything completely, the total report is generated from the machine itself. So what is the technology of the uh, fully automated or the completely automated analyzer? It is very similar to the hematology analyzer. Even the completely automated urine analyzer uses flow cytometry along with impedance. So here what happens is along with the report, if you want to cross check, verify any report in your hematology analyzer, usually the pathologist correlates with the histograms and the scatterograms. Similarly, in a urine analyzer which is completely automated, which is the higher end urine analyzer, you also get scattergrams and histograms because the technology used here is flow cytometry. And from that, you can verify or correlate your reports and your values. So this is about the urine analysis. Here, you would ask me one simple question, which will be also an important uh, question for you to change your laboratory practice. Why should I change from a manual method of reporting to a semi-automated or an automated system of urine analyzer? I would like to give you four disadvantages of using a manual urine analyzer. These are as follow. The first disadvantage, subjective element identification. The second thing is that there will be poor reproducibility. Third thing is lack of standardization. And the fourth one is that it is a time consuming and a labor intensive process. So these are all technician dependent parameters of using a manual method of urine analyzer. So when you're going to automate, when you're going to scale up your laboratory, when you want to be at par with your standard laboratories, it is mandatory for you to upgrade your laboratory to at least a semi-automated or a completely automated laboratory according to the caseload you have. If you want to identify which machine would be best suitable for your diagnostic center, you can contact us at pathlabstartup at gmail.com or you can directly WhatsApp as you can put a message in the number mentioned below. For any other queries, if you want to establish your center, if you want to scale up your diagnostic center, if you want a laboratory consultancy, you can always mail us and we are there to guide you. This is Dr. Lalita Center signing off. <music>